Today is Hadrian's Zoo Locally Produced Trade Fair. Um, the Locally Produced Scheme was relaunched last year and now we've got over 100 members in the scheme. It's arts and crafts, producers and food and drink. Um, we bring them together at this event so they can showcase their products. We're joined with Tyndale Distribution Day, so again we've got b and b self-catering accommodation providers coming in so they can see the products and the food and drink that are available in the region so not only they can use it in their establishments but they can promote it to visitors when they come to the area and they can see the quality of products that we have in Hadrian's Oil Country. But visitors when they come to the region want to um, buy local gifts and they also want to you know, taste products from the region and if we take something away with them. My name's Emma Burnett, I'm from the Northumbrian Chocolate Company. I produce handmade chocolates in Bellingham, um, Belgian chocolates, truffles, spiced bites. I'm the hundredth member of Hadrian's Wall Locally Produced. Um, and I think it's important to buy local at the minute because local trade is the most important to local people. Yeah, my name is Neil Maxwell. I run the uh, ice cream business at uh, Doddington near Willow with my wife Jackie. Um, we decided to have a uh, to go off on a slight tangent and produce a, a product that nobody else is doing. Uh, we've got Roman flavours. We've got flavours of. Roman Britain, which were inspired by the Vindolanda tablets, where a, a homesick Roman soldier uh, wrote a, a list for a dinner party, a shopping list for a dinner party, and he wanted 100 apples if the quality could be guaranteed. Um, they're mixed with uh, our own fresh cow's milk um, and double cream uh, sugar and egg yolks, and no other artificial flavourings or colourings or anything like that. Um, just the actual flavour you, uh, you see, so it's, if it's cherries, it, that, that gives the cherry ice cream, apples and cinnamon for the apple and cinnamon ice cream and obviously Tweedside Heather honey that we get from the Chainbridge Honey Farm for the honey ice cream. 